respect. Show some fucking respect. He's our publicist. He's trying his best. Just relax and know that he still has our backs. That would be ungrateful. You know, just take it easy. When I come home, we can talk about it. No, I'm not home. I love you too, girlfriend. I'm on set. I'm shooting that commercial I told you about. You know they run for me. I spot you from afar, baby. You know you make a mad, baby. Mad, baby. I like the way you are, baby. You make me young, cause I cry, baby. I go give you all the vibes. Make you know the stress, stress. Your back up, girl, I'm impressed. I go die for your mother. Forget the rest. If you know they will make you all the mess. I go give you all the vibes. Make you know the stress, stress. Your back up. Girl, I'm impressed, I could die for your mother Eh, hey, forget the rest If you don't dare, we make get all this a mess I want you from my family I I'm not watching 
Why? Did I miss a game? Bullshit. Where were you? <laughs> Chrissy, look, I'm not your girlfriend, though. Don't come back. I'm your publicist! Before anybody mentions you, my name comes up. I picked you up from a sleazy music video when you were twerking for 19 year old dropouts who are still living with their parents. You left home dressed like you work for a Catholic priest only to change in one of the mall bathrooms into Nicki Minaj. By the time you got home to fetch water for your grandma, you had changed again. Pentecost style. Your poor grandma couldn't see through your lies even if she was given a, a, a microscope. Fast forward to today. Thanks to me, your name is written in gold. 12 awards and counting. 13. I'm the one with the 12 awards and counting. Contract's a contract, my friend. I made you, Bertha. And I know what you've been doing behind my back. And what have I been doing? Oh, does the name Philip Mensa ring a bell? Is that what you're mad about? Shouldn't I be? I was just at his staff member's send-off party. And that was like how many days ago? And you didn't think I should know that? What's the big deal? Wait, are you thinking there's something else going on here? <laughs> I am thinking you are overstepping your bounds. You know why? <laughs> it's a small town. I know Philip Mesa. I know how he plays! Hello. What's the matter with him? Did he have to mention the part about you twerking? I run his shopping center back at our old place. My husband is a lawyer. Oh wow, that's nice. <laughs> what about that? Hello? My God, which police station please? Brother.
So my friend next door needs some help. Her brother was picked up for rape or murder or something. Did he do it? Can you help him out? He says, he says it was consensual. What did the rape victim say? I haven't met her. In some womb, here we come. What's that? Give her some hope. Do you believe her? As in? That he didn't do it? Actually, this isn't the first time. Not a murder. The rape. So he has police record already. How did that case go? That one. He went in for two years. He will go in for long, I can guarantee you. Okay, let's see what I can do. Thank you. Please. Like I told your wife, I don't have enough money to pay for your services.
those chances. Baby, I'm a lawyer, not a judge. Poor girl. She never met her dad. Her mom had to relocate to the village because of so much frustrations. I can see you found yourself a new gossip partner, right? I just need you to help her, baby. Baby, the political season has begun. I have lots of cleaning up to do before the witch hunting begins. I can't start chasing these minor cases. So who is your client this time? Danny D. Souza. He's running for president. He was at our wedding, right? Yeah, you remember him. <coughs> Baby, not now, please. You promised. I know, but I'm busy. Baby, our marriage is starving. We both saw these online. I know you've forgotten. I purposely got this because I wanted to surprise you. And now Where you is that thing, you that cotton thing you put in your ear when your partner is disturbing you? Really? <laughs> okay, so which one is it gonna be? It's it uh red or black? Or black or red? <laughs> <laughs>
Good riddance to bad rubbish. So, did Philip Mensah give you enough money to take me somewhere nice? Pardon? How much did Philip Mensah give you? We... I thought that... But come on, no one, no one, no one has to pay me to date my celebrity <laughs> crush. <laughs> Very flattering. But you are lying, sweetheart. Oh, how would I? Better. This is a dream come true for me, you know. I... Oh, are you having a change of mind? If you don't feel like you're in the mood... Like, we could always... I'm not. Uh, what? I left my card inside. I can't go back in right now. So, do you have enough money? Like how much? Enough to take us somewhere nice. A nice hotel would be great. I'm guessing you'd like to stay the night. I don't have so much for tonight, but maybe... But, uh, do you have a card? A card with money on it? Yeah, sure, sure. I have a card. Okay. Yeah. Uh, wait. Are you seeing someone? No. Let's go. I'd like to be on your campaign team. Oh well. I admire confidence in me already. <laughs> You're welcome aboard. Excuse me, sir. Gentlemen, this is going to be a beautiful campaign. <laughs> Good catch, Cuckoo.